Hey Harry Potter fans, Peter Kenneth here. Welcome to the Potter Collector Channel, where we are a community of collectors. Oh my goodness, you guys. It's finally been released. The Cine Replicas Firebolt Broomstick Replica. Now we have seen Firebolt Replicas in the past, but none of them have been made out of wood. So Cine Replicas makes their replicas out of wood. They made a replica of the Nimbus 2000, which is stunning, my favorite broomstick in my collection. Although this one might take the cake. If you wanna see that broomstick, check the description down below. I'll leave a link. But right now, we get to unbox, finally, the Cine Replicas Firebolt Replica. This is what the box looks like when you order it. I recommend saving these boxes, or at least the foam on the inside. So sometimes I will cosplay with these brooms, and the foam is formed to the broomstick itself, so it really helps with traveling with your broom to make sure that your broomstick arrives safely and undamaged. All right, we have some paperwork on the inside. Here, let me show you what I'm seeing in the box. So this is how your broomstick arrives. You have to assemble it. And there's also some paperwork. These are the instructions on how to assemble. These are the assembly instructions. And they also have a little QR code on here, which will take you to a video if you would rather see a video about the assembly process of the broom. And then there's another card in here that says, Firebolt Handmade Disclaimer. Our firebolts are handmade. They are unique, and as a result, not one broom is identical to the other. Rest assured that all are made with the same amount of attention and care. We have a footrest here and another over here. This is going to be your certificate of authenticity. I'll show you guys that in a second. Each of their broomsticks comes with a certificate of authenticity. I'm not sure what this little thing is. The broom with real wood bristles. I'm not going to be able to say that enough. Real wood. This is not plastic. This is not resin. We have a real broomstick right here. Now the Firebolt is first introduced in Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. It's actually a gift from Sirius Black. We don't know that it's a gift from Sirius Black until the end of the book, but this is the fastest broomstick model in the Harry Potter series, which goes up to 150 miles per hour. I'm gonna open up this first, but before we do that, let's take a look at this wrapping, this packaging. We've got brown paper package tied up with string and some amazing Harry Potter related Quidditch printing on it. Love this. Absolutely love this. All right, this right here is something very fun. And it's not something I think I would have thought about if I were like creating the broomstick. We have a feather, a hippogriff feather. At the end of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, the movie, Harry opens up the firebolt and inside is a feather from a hippogriff. It's Buckbeak's feather, and that is Sirius's way to say, hey, I'm the one who sent you this broomstick. So Cine Replicas has sent a feather along with this stretchy elastic, so you can put it on the handle of the broomstick and display the feather with the broom. That's just a fun nod to Sirius Black. I'm excited about this broom because this is gonna be one that's really close to screen accurate. Now we've seen other broomsticks from other companies and the metal parts have been silver. The metal parts are actually supposed to be like a copper color. If you've seen the props like at the Warner Brothers Studio Tour in London or at the Harry Potter Store in New York, you'll notice that the metal portion, the footrests, as well as the bars and the rings and the clasps are more of a copper color. Now these are a little bit brighter and more yellow than copper, but again not silver, which is awesome. All right, let's open up the certificate of authenticity. And that's made out of metal, which is fun. The whole packaging and just display of this is fantastic. This says limited edition, Firebolt, limited to 10,000 pieces worldwide. This handmade masterpiece is numbered 759 out of 10,000. Love that. And then it has like an anti-scratch material on the back so it doesn't scratch the surface of your table or wherever you decide to display this. Now I'm really curious about this little doodad right here. Maybe this is like a screw or a screwdriver or I don't know. Oh, it is. <laughs> it's a little wrench and this is what you're gonna use to attach all the pieces to your Firebolt. Let's finish unwrapping everything. So rest assured, your Firebolt, if you order one of these, will arrive safely. So well wrapped. Number two. All right, who's ready for the handle? I know I'm ready for the handle. Oh, look at that thing. That is, it's amazing that this is wood. 
This is carved out of wood. Oh my word. Look at that detail of like the, the natural wood and then the gray painted wood and then the gold lettering. Wow, that is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. All the lines and divots and so nice. Real wood, that's amazing. Now this is gonna be very exciting. This is the bristles. They are made of wood, like they're actual wood bristles. I'll let you guys see it first. Oh my word. Oh wow. I love the use of different sized bristles too. Just makes it feel more authentic. Oh, this is absolutely stunning. Look at this. It's like a real broomstick. This is something you would go to Quality Quidditch Supplies and purchase. Like it even has the buds on it still. Like, this is awesome. I do wish that the gold was a little bit toned down, more of a copper, but the gold is stunning, absolutely stunning. This is movable a little bit so you can adjust it. Let's put this thing together. So we've got the instructions here and the first step is to attach the footrests to the broom bristles themselves. And what's nice is on the inside of the footrests, there's an R or an L which tells you which side. So this is the right side. So now we're going to tighten the foot pedal and then tighten the other screw at the top here. One side done. Look at that! Look at how gorgeous that is! All right, so we have the foot pedals attached. What's next? Then we just twist the broom handle onto the bottom of the broomstick. And there you have it! Your very own fire bolt made out of wood. It's made out of wood. I can't stress that enough. This thing is huge! This is awesome. This is an absolutely stunning broom. I love the fact that it's real wood. I love the fact that there's some gold detail. It stands up beautifully on a table or your shelf. And I'm sure that there's a way that you could hang this on your wall. If you put down the foot rests, it would just make for a stunning, stunning piece. This is so awesome and I think it's worth the wait. Now these fire bolts are limited to 10,000 worldwide. Once they hit that 10,000 sold mark, they're gone. So if you have dreamed of owning a real wooden firebolt, this is your chance. Sin Replicas is the only place that you can get one. The only thing I wish this broomstick could do is fly, but it'll display great. Now here it is with the foot rests in their kind of resting position, and this is how it's gonna display best on your walls. So I just pulled up a picture of the firebolt that's on display at the Harry Potter store. It's, it's one of the props that were used. And the gold isn't that far off. I think if this was a little bit more tarnished, not quite as bright, it would be very, very close to the one that was used in the films. A huge shout out to Cine Replicas for sending this broomstick for me to show you guys. It is an absolute blast to finally be able to reveal it and really experience it in person. We've seen the pictures, we've seen the Cine Replicas behind the scenes making video, and now I'm actually holding one and you can hold one too. These broomsticks are already selling, so check the description down below for information and links if you would like to add a wooden Firebolt to your collection. If you have any questions about Harry Potter or collecting, feel free to leave a comment down below. You can also join the Potter Collector community on Instagram, at the Potter Collector, or on Twitter, at Potter Collector. Now it's time to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, keep collecting. Thank you so much for watching, and if you're new here, welcome. We cover all things Harry Potter on the Potter Collector channel, like books, merchandise reviews, unboxings, Wizarding World of Harry Potter videos, and more. If you would like to subscribe, you can click right here. You can also check out a previously posted video right around here. If you have any questions about Harry Potter, feel free to leave a comment down below. I am happy to help. But for now, I must go. We'll see you next time. Whoa, where'd he go?